Porto. Maximus, um, yesterday he was acting really funny and he was doing his shakes. If you guys don't know much about Maximus, he's he's just been one thing after another with health problems like when we got him his one toe was infected so we had to get his toe removed then a little bit ago his dick exploded like I don't even like gluten to make your dick fly off but I mean I don't know what the hell happened to his his penis but it exploded at like his foreskin that normally sits over top of a duck's penis you know um, it folded back on itself and was cutting off circulation so they it was full of blood and just dripping blood it was nasty like fucking nasty so I had to take him to the emerge and they cut down the penis and then they flopped it back over and sewed it back up that poor bastard like that that is the only time i heard him whimper in his whole life was when his dick exploded he's also recently like i think about six months now he started getting shakes and tremors in his back feet like his whole body shakes and he pitter patters his back feet we took him to the vet and we were going to go see a specialist but thank goodness the vet that we go to she took a video and sent it to the specialist because if we would have had to go and see him we would have had to go over the states and that would have been long and annoying. So she sent a video to him, instantly got diagnosed, and he has orthostatic tremor syndrome. It's a progressive disease. Um, it's non-curable. It's only lessened with medication. So it's kind of like Parkinson's for dogs. They don't know very much about it. They don't know if it's like a few months and it gets really bad and then he has to get put down or if it's a few years and it gets really bad and he gets put down. But I mean like it's such an unknown disease that they don't even know how to cure it, how to like fix it or revert it so we just have pills that he has to take every day to lessen the symptoms of it but eventually it's just gonna get really bad well, yesterday I thought they were getting really really bad because he was shaking like his whole body was going he was panting like crazy and he was limping and I was like why is he limping so yesterday I started squeezing the front foot that he kept lifting up and I squeezed the toes, I squeezed the ankle, I squeezed his elbow. He wasn't whimpering at all. So I was like, okay, so he didn't hurt his foot. So it's probably gotta be something neurological with his tremor disease. And so this morning I just woke up and went to take him outside and his front foot is swollen as fuck. So this dumbass dog did something and broke his fucking foot. He's just been one problem after another. Like, is there a return policy on dogs? Like, I want a refund. Why I get broke dog? I don't want broke dog. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. Like, I love the shit out of him. But seriously, his fucking foot is so swollen. Like, I'll show you guys, okay? So this is his regular paw, which is still freaking huge, as you guys can see. So that's the regular one. And... Sorry, honey. Sorry. I'm sorry. This is the other one. So obviously he broke this toe. Like it's fucking giant. Look at that thing. But he's not whimpering. He's not doing anything. But I had to like carry him inside and stuff. But that bitch is broke. Yeah. Yeah, you broke it. Didn't you? So now I've got to wait for them to open up. I already called the vet and told her what was going on. So once they open, I've got to pack him up in the vehicle and drive him to the vet and hopefully get it fixed. I don't know if they're gonna give him a cast. I don't know if they're gonna like fix a broken foot, toe bone, I don't know. But we will see what happens and I will keep you guys updated. Oh, he keeps coming towards me. Hi. Or toe. Look how tiny it is compared to him. Goodbye. <laughs> Holy shit, I look disgusting. So my mom and sister came 
came over today and we had planned on going to the farmer's market and as you guys know, Max had a little incident where I thought he broke his foot. We just took him to the vet and he has an infection in his toe. Infection. Infection. Yeah. He has an infection in his toe. And we're, we got some antibiotics to hopefully clear it up and everything. And I also increased, got an increase of his phenobar for his shakes. And now we are just heading back to drop him off so he can hang out with Lily while we go to the farmer's market. Hey, my mommy. Say hi, mommy. Hi, mommy. Really? <laughs> really? Devin, say hi. No? Okay, I love you too. We just got finished at the farmer's market. We managed to get there still in time after taking Max to the vet. They got a few little things. I didn't get anything. I'm gonna get this weekend when I'm with Matt. Oh yeah, I got some apples. But I'm gonna go with Matt so he can get his like breakfast sausages. I hope you guys enjoyed watching today's vlog with my mom and my sister. I'm just heading to bed now. Don't forget to like, share, favorite, and subscribe to our channel to give you more reasons to smile. And thank you guys so much for watching. Have a good night, see you tomorrow. Bye. Over to Port Huron. We're going stateside in order to pick up a package. It is to fix his mom's car, which we are buying off of them for me. So we are going over there to get the package and maybe some grub, who knows?